We begin tonight with breaking news. More than a dozen train cars have derailed at the CSX rail yard in Selkirk. Right now, crews are at the scene cleaning up the mess and trying to figure out how it all happened. Houston ABC's Rachel Young Kunis is there and she joins us live with more. Rachel, what have you learned so far? Mark, officials tell me that around 20 to 25 cars derailed. Now it happened way back. Well, there's a car going behind me now, but it's way back in the heart of the Selkirk rail yard. Selkirk Fire Chief Bill Aspirin tells me that this was kind of a domino effect. One car may have went down and caused the other ones, but there is the cause of this derailment is still unknown at this time, though there were no injuries reported, and I'm told there were no hazardous materials in most of those cars. Some of them, though, did have some hazardous materials. Now, right now, CSX is working to clear the tracks. It has affected their travel at this time. They will bring in a bulldozer-type machine to clear the tracks, but this uh, this as I mentioned, there are no injuries reported, but some of those cars, they came close to propane tanks. However, Chief Aspirin tells me that there was no sense of danger. They cleared the scene and made sure everything is safe. We've surveyed the scene. There's a couple cars in there with some type of hazardous material on it. They have not been impacted in any way, shape, or form from any of the other cars that are derailed. Most of the cars that are derailed are empties. Now, if they need to call the Selkirk Fire Department back, Chief Aspirin tells me that CSX will do so if something happens or they need help to clear these tracks. But right now, the fire department has left the scene. Again, the cause of this derailment is unknown at this time, but this is an ongoing investigation to determine what exactly what could have happened. Live in Selkirk, I'm Rachel Young Kunis, News 10, ABC.